Hello. So this is my last night at the beach. Um, you can see a little bit of the decor um, inside the house. It's a A-frame, which I think I've already mentioned. Um, I'm really sad I don't want to go. Uh, I just <laughs> remembered to wear my nightgown that I got. I say nightgown. It was from the show, the new show, Busy Tonight. And I fell in love with a nightgown, um, which turns out is not a nightgown. It's a dress, and it's about $250, but I bought it anyway. I'm like the worst. Like, who buys a $250 dress, like, the week after gastric bypass? Um, but <laughs> I don't know. It's I bought an extra large in, like, regular, and it fit just because it's so blousey. So it'll just end up being, like, a hippie, flowy dress. Or it is, but um, no guilt here because uh, it's it's a great piece to wear at the beach when you're just lounging and it's too cold to actually lay on the beach. So I've been inside a lot, but there's a lot of great windows and can just take a nap on the couch and still have like a panoramic view of the ocean. So um, just I want to reflect a little bit on my eating since I've been here. Um, I have not been hungry, but I think I'm starting to get the hunger brain that people were talking about because I don't want to eat like any of the food that I'm supposed to eat. And it's like, I'd rather just not eat, but I know I can't not eat like my lunch, um, protein shake today. I had the premier protein caramel and I measured out three ounces. I think I'm actually supposed to have four, but I wanted it to last a couple or, you know, until tomorrow. So I didn't have to open another one. And it took me like an hour to drink it, not because it was hard to drink. I just did not feel like drinking it. Um, so that I guess probably isn't good. And then I went to Harris Teeter and got some tomato soup and cottage cheese because I'm so over the, the sweet stuff. But at this stage, we still have to have the protein, which is like by default sweet. And I had applesauce in the morning. It's so funny, like I brought a lot of food, but didn't necessarily, or not a lot of food. I mean, I brought like four protein shakes um, two cans of soup that really I could just have the broth for it and a bunch of water. And I've only, been, I've only been here three days, but you know, to drink, uh, I mean, one protein shake takes a little over a day, like basically four meals. So I didn't need all the protein shakes. <laughs> um, but that's okay. You know, I mean, this is like the cheapest vacation ever. I didn't have to go out to eat or when I was here in July, I think like almost every day I went to Dairy Queen. Uh, so I definitely did not do that this time. Um, it actually might not even be open because so many businesses are se seasonal here that they just close. Uh, but um, I think it was a night, I, obviously I wish it was warmer so that I could have spent some time on the beach at least walking, but I was really stupid. I didn't even bring a coat or, you know, any type of shoes that would be warm enough. Um, so I really didn't even have that option. Like a couple times a day I go out on the deck and try and stand it as long as I can, but it's a little too cold for me, uh, or at least too cold for the, the clothing that I brought. It's, you know, in the fifties, which for, I think some of the northerners that, that relocated here is not that bad, but you know, for me being from Florida originally, um, and then just being a wimp in general, I can't, I cannot stand that much time on the beach. Um, but the sun is starting to go down now, which pains me to say, cause it's like 440 PM. Um, I have the sunrise view, so I able, was able to see that this morning, but that's just, you know, a little bit about my post-surgery beach vacation. I'm, let's see, probably 10, no. 13 days out because yeah, tomorrow is Monday. So tomorrow, tomorrow will be two weeks since I've had the surgery. Oh, one thing is there's no scale here. So I basically have not weighed myself in three days. Um, and I have like that scared feeling like 
did I gain weight? Which I mean, is obviously impossible because I've had less than 200 calories per day. Now I know that there can be a stall, but I'm must not have gained weight. And, but you know, I still like, I did think about bringing my scale with me, um, to weigh myself here. Um, but I'm sure it'll be fine. I just, you know, I want to know because I know it's good news. And I think that's probably why. <laughs> um, so anyways, that's all for now. And, um, I'll give you more of my nightgown, <laughs> my $300 nightgown. Um, anyway, Oh, look, there's Mr. Collarbones coming through. Okay. <laughs> this is getting silly. So time to uh, say goodnight.